In episode four, we hear Porkins being told to eject, but does that make any sense? I mean, he's in the middle of space. He's got no respirator and he's got an open faced helmet. Well, this is something the Star Wars Legends expanded universe has tried to grapple with, most notably in the X-Wing series. In those novels, X-Wing pilots often went extra vehicular or EV and how they were protected is basically the seat would eject through the top of the ship. There's actually one case where the canopy didn't open and the pilot was crushed by it, but the seat would also project a force field which would keep heat and oxygen needed for the pilot to stay alive. That being said, it was still an extremely dangerous situation. There was not an unlimited supply of energy to power the shield, and you were still usually in the middle of a space battle. On one occasion, we saw Mara Jade while EV hit by an ion blast. She was very seriously injured but would make a recovery. In another case, Jaina Solo was essentially badly irradiated, even losing her vision temporarily by the engines of a nearby cruiser. 